Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the rail end cap in a GE dishwasher. It's going to be a very easy repair. should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a flat blade screwdriver. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new rail end cap. There are four rail end caps in this dishwasher. They are installed at the ends of the upper dish rack rails to prevent the dish rack from falling off of the rail. The main reason why the rail end cap should be replaced is if it's broken, causing the upper dish rack to fall out. To get to the part, we need to open the door. Let's pull the upper dish rack and slide it back so we can expose this uh, rail end cap. To remove the rail end cap, you can either open this tab with your finger or use a flat blade screwdriver. I'm going to use a flat blade screwdriver. Uh, pull it up here on the side and uh, slide it off. This is the old rail end cap next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from appliancepartspros.com. To place on the rail end cap, we need to place it on the rail and then uh, push it in so the side tab will lock. Now we can uh, roll in the upper dish rack and close the door. Lock the dishwasher in and enjoy your clean dishes. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other videos available on our site, on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram.